up, guys? My name's Ariana. And I'm Maple. And today we are watching season one, episode seven of Severance. Let's get into it. You know, we... Just follow her. You're stressing me out because if the if you don't follow her, you're about to get snatched by the weird head of security. Well, I don't know if they even say he's the head of security, but that's what I'm assuming. I'm he's sick of stairwells. I'm I sick hate of the stairwells. stairwells, dog. Who are you? I'm the one who helped your friend. Helped? You mean reintegration? I'm the one who she helped her, your friend. She's got crazy eyes a little bit. If he had followed my post-op instructions and not simply run away at the first sign of sickness. So you, you, you're a doctor? I put that chip in your head, and I'm still the only one who can deactivate it. Maybe I don't want it deactivated. Right. Well, maybe your any does. You wonder what he thinks about all this, don't you? You wonder if he's happy? Mm. Yeah, but he's not right now. Me. So infantilizing. You ain't wrong. Then again, you've been severed for two years, right? Mm -hmm. So your innie really is still just a baby. My innie lives his own life. And as a result, uh, I get to live mine. Ooh. <clears throat> but maybe he doesn't. Maybe he dreams every day about clawing his way to the surface. You brought him into this world without his permission. Oh, God. Based on your own desire for emotional convenience. Wow. Ooh, hit him with it. No, I mean... I think you want to do what's right. She's okay. losing it, man. Her eyes are very... She's like a Senpaku eyes, mm. kind of. like. Oh. We work together. Down there. Mm. He knows. You having a chat with someone, Mark? I'm a friend. No, he's not. Ooh, shit. Dude, good job. Dude, she Ooh. took him out. Yeah, kill, is she gonna kill him? Yo, I don't. She's oh, at she's least gonna, gonna stop him. until he's knocked out. What? Oh, that's so I know, scary. This has to be you're like, so what, bad for like, him because he has no idea. For? Like, yeah. What side am I on? Oh, Could you imagine? Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. Well, you live in a neighborhood by yourself, mm -hmm. bud. I mean, the, the oh, at this point. I need a throw up. Okay. Throw up right now. Take it to work tomorrow. He'll know what to do. I will know what to do. You, Petey's phone, give it to me. I'll take care of this. Wow, she's just Get not home. letting him in. Get rid of your clothes. Or she's trying to keep him safe. Because unless, well, I know, but yeah. she's, yeah, and she is, but like, she's not letting him in on like the what's actually yeah. going on, you know? Started, Mark. That guy's dead. Oh, bro, she told you not to puke. At least it's outside. Well, it's still in the tunnel area. I know, and it's kind of cold there right now. A little frozen. She said, don't puke. Your DNA's in it. If I would have vomited, I immediately would have, like, taken off my coat and tried to get as much of it, like... Yeah. Ugh. It just... It, ugh. I don't understand how people will do that. Like, I, some people just... I mean, I don't, I don't even know. She believes she's doing whatever she's doing for the right reasons. So. Well, I mean, in that situation, she's obviously protecting herself. Right. Because he was looking for her. Yeah. And she probably knew that, mm -hmm. you know? <clears throat> oh, shoot. Yeah, he's going to have to do something with, what, all of his clothes? Mm -hmm. But do not put in your own trash, man. Is this chick in his house again? I think the chick's been in his house. The chick that stayed over. He left her in bed. Uh, well, I'm talking about neighbor Miss, uh... Miss, yeah. Miss What's-Her-Butt. Corbell in disguise. Where were you? Who, me? Yeah. <clears throat> You're being weird. Yeah, he is, because somebody uh, just got murked in front of him. Dream. Just... I really hope she's not, like, working with <laughs> Loomis. Do you want me to go? That's tough. Mm hmm. Given the context. But I'm only human. <laughs> he needs some time. And also, given what just happened, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Put it in your pocket. Put it in your pocket. Definitely, wh whatever you do, don't leave it in the house. Yeah, no, definitely not. Cause... Uh uh. Home girl, don't find it. Mark! Mark! Your 
out early in all this snowiness. Uh, you usually dispose of your waste in the early afternoon. You look troubled, Mark. Huh? I hate her so Maybe much. We should talk later over a nice hot cup of lavender tea. Uh, <laughs> like, she is wrong for that. She's sick. She is sick. Also, her smay. You, you work in the name of Kia. You child. You child. Ah! She is emotionally dysregulated, I would say. Yo, homie farked up, man. It clearly works. How many times do you have to check it, bud? I don't know. My anxiety makes me check things a lot sometimes. Yeah, and I love that they're locking them in, but he has an all-access card now. Yes, he does. And they probably won't, if they're locked in that room, probably won't be but thinking about you... uh, monitoring them maybe that much because mm -hmm. they're locked in the room. That's they probably have no why he's looking at it 16 times. <clears throat> but I guess my other question is, though, too, is can it be opened from the inside? That's what he was just doing. Oh, I thought he was, he was standing on the, on the outside, outside and okay. then he moved to the inside, yeah. But it was like kind of one fast little Oh, the cards. He's trying to get the card. Where is it? Also, why does that card mean so much? It's like Sorry, didn't mean yeah. but like stop the fans. You know, stay in your little green screen box. No, just well, I was just imitating the boo. You've been a great leader to this department, Bertie. Thank you. You deserve something special. Okay. Not, that sounds scary. Not a trip to the break room, I hope. Yesterday was quite enough. Mm. Something else. Stay tuned. He's so weird. Like, everybody just keeps getting weirder and weirder. Stop trying to bring the mini afro back, too. Dylan G. Good morning. Oh, he had to be there to meet him. That? Yeah, exactly. How's he gonna play this one off? Happened last night is called the overtime contingency. It's a safeguard we occasionally <clears throat> employ to remotely awaken workers off site. You never told us you could do that. Mm. It's for emergency use only. And I didn't consult Miss Cobell because she's been so stressed. And because you've Boy, messed up, my guy. Was he, was that my son? Yep. Not knowing is probably for the best. Or it's kind of really messed up. And it can't be linked to anyone, and it's already Lumen property, so it's something that's mm -hmm. expected to pass through. Eventually, there's no technical writing. Marcus, good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Why are you happy? You were not happy last time I saw you. So am I going to the... I'm here to escort you to your desk. New protocol. Oh, yeah. I love a, a little, little bit of jazzy. I like some lounge music. That's mm. just what I was going to say. Mm. I prefer the phrase safely situated. These hmm. words help us to ensure you all are tucked nicely in your workspaces. <laughs> Did Mr. Grainer order this? Mm. Wow, everybody's already there. How are you doing, Earth? I'm well, thank you. I've, the renovations are very nice. Yeah, yeah okay. So I lean my upper body slightly forward <clears throat> while cradling the top of the neck. Oh my oh, it's god. One of those. She's doing her lactation I consulting. So I just like just do not trust her, boobs. man. Like at all. I do this? <laughs> now you try. I know it's a doll, but dang. Now you try. Just whip that thing around. Good yeah. lord. Whatever happened to the soap labels? He's so funny. The soap label? We all know it's soap. <laughs> Seems like an O and D question. Earth. You know we can't go anywhere. I mean, I get that you're worried about Bert. Suppose he's being disciplined for our visit. Suppose he is, thanks to you. Mm. If only someone had told you that going there was a <laughs> idea from the jump. Oh man. Come on, Good day, let's not finest. project. What's this? You have earned for you and your fellow refiners a five minute music dance experience. Mr. Five Richard, minutes to shake that thing. Really percent. And I thought a little frivolity would be just what the doctor ordered. <laughs> approach the MDE cart. Approach the cart. You may choose oh, one and one accessory. 
Mm. Buoyant reggae. <laughs> Defiant jazz. Ooh. Though this experience is in Heli's honor. Dude, we were just talking about jazz. Boogie. <laughs> boogie. Let's boogie. Let's boogie. I will say, Milchek, his actor, is very cute. Even yes. though he plays a scary character. Yeah. He is a very good looking man. He really is. I and just... he just kind of has like an essence to him, mm -hmm. I feel like, maybe as a person. I don't know. He's got that swag. He's just like, oh, look at very the... like. So I guess like they haven't even experienced music in this like no or dancing yeah like she said like you're just you're new yeah oh, she he's bit him he's biting me Dylan get the hell Jesus he's biting me Dylan come on go <laughs> Hey, yeah, that's down, Dylan. bad. The I'm reporting this to Miss Cobell. Yeah, you oh, want yeah? to see her together? Mmm. Oh, he's got a leg up on him now. Yeah, he does. He put himself in danger with the book, with with the kid getting caught, with everything. Also, I'm sorry. Too many outside factors. You really think a child is going to experience follow? Canceled. Oh God. There was some seen somebody insert and uninsert there. Please retry your card. I'm gonna start swiping oh, my card like oh, that. What? He's telling. Oh. It's called the overtime contingency. Mm. What are you mm. talking about? Last night, after I went up the elevator, I woke up outside in my house with Milchik. What? Yeah. Helly's like Helly's gonna be in on. Yeah. Mm. Now I'm just supposed to have that in my head every day here. I never yeah. see him again. We could use this. What? If they can wake us up on the outside, what's to stop us from doing it to ourselves? True. What's to stop That's us? That's what I'm saying. She's mm -hmm. like, we can find whatever they use to control it and, you know, commandeer it. Plus, the controls are surely somewhere we can't access. Like the security office? Why does your Audi have the key card of our head of security? Honestly, good on him for biting Milchak. Mm -hmm. I was thinking that. I was like, thinking, I was like, what if they all attack him? And then it, it manifested in this episode. Like this works. You better be fast about it, though. That's the only thing. Like, yeah, but he's going to have that. He's going to have to go to the doctor immediately to get that bite. Oh, treated. yeah. Or else th that's bad. I'm sorry, Mark. Where are you going? I have to make sure Bert's OK. All access. I mean, even if it's not, mm -hmm. you can go anywhere. There's got to be a system where they know that that key's being used for the simple fact that, like, it's, it's Grainer's card. Everyone knows it's Grainer's card, and they know he didn't come in today. Yeah. So I wonder if that's going down, going anywhere, like that information, like where that's going to currently. Oh man, look at all the monitors. See, I think it's a lot smaller group of people that must be controlling them. I mean, because oh, yeah. really, we've only seen Milchek. Grainer and yeah. what's her face? Flip a switch. Damn, just press one, you know? Mm hmm. That's us. Descending. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Cobell? Yeah. What? Let's get the out of here. Good, good, go, good, good, go, good. Go, At least go. she stole it. Like, you better not be out. Like, do not. Oh, my God. Oh. For you. Oh, no. It's okay. I have the board here. Oh. Oh, snap. The board here? And we'll be available to meet with you at the Egan Family Gala next week to discuss this further. There's going so to be a gala. gala. She's so scary. She is so scary. Like, no sh no lie. Like, terrifying. I feel like the, the people who are more intermediaries between anyone in the situations, have it the worst. We've got a melon party. That melon looks delectable. You just engage the trackball, type the code, then it's switch, type, flip, type, hold. What? Trackball, type, switch, type, flip, type, hold. Boom. 
I'm smart. That's why I have three times as many finger traps as you guys. <laughs> <laughs> One of us has to stay behind, right? Yeah. After work, I can do it. I've already been out, so it's only fair. Very noble of you, but I think it's designed as a two-man operation. Great, I have the strength of two men. <laughs> so who did he get to help him? They're on either side of the door. Yeah, I right? Who did Milchek get to help him? We've only ever Ladies seen... and gentlemen, how about a round of applause for no. the man of the hour, huh? <laughs> and, and the timeline for me there is a little fuzzy because it's like... Because Garner was following like, him. Because that was all happening at the same time. So maybe somebody from O&D? Or one of the people who's permanently there? This is for you. He's leaving. Bye-bye? Yeah. Christopher Walken, and he's kind of adorable sometimes. Oh, he really is. <clears throat> like, I just feel like he'd be really funny in person. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna stand here and let him die. You smug mother. Ooh! Ooh! You're not severed. You walk out of here with your memories. You carry them home with you every night. Mm-hmm. No one he's can breaking. them away from you. Snuff them out like they never existed. Dude, he's having a rough mm -hmm. time. Exists enough. You will go back to MDR. Mr. Milchick, please. It'd be so wonderful to have him here. He is losing power, and he has no idea how to handle it. Well, because he. Yeah. I mean, it's very clear that mm -hmm. everyone. You can stay for both is afraid of. Uh, mm -hmm. But only if you behave in a manner. Cornell is no anything? shame upon yourself. Corbell. Corbell. Founder or his Corbell. I, I don't even know anymore. I know. She's All the names are just scary. like standing in my brain. Scary lady. What's gotten yeah. into you people today? Um, what's gotten into you, bud? This show stresses me out so bad. <laughs> The shadows of mystery. They should have kissed when they were in the plant room. I know. The good times have I hate it. It feels scary. Mm -hmm. Bye bye, Bert. The others in between. I wonder if he's going right to the break room or if he's going back to MDR. So gather. Irving. Let's burn this place to the ground. Yes. Mm. Yeah. We have a coup. We have a coup. We... Screw you, Kev, or whatever. The, what's that guy's name? In the words of Kia. 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 Screw you. Egon. Egan. Egon. E yeah. Know. Egan. Whatever. Egan family. Screw you. Suck it, Egan. My phone. Right. Yeah. Come on in. He is How are you? drunk as a skunk. I'm um, good. How are you? It's great. Come on in. Mm. Are you okay? No. Yeah, I'm fine. <gasps> oh. What? That really added to the mood, though. Holy cow. I know. I don't think she'd want that, though. Mm -mm. It's almost like, like, like backhanded compliments what? or like you know like if you're mm -hmm. willing to do that to like the memory of your yeah. ex-wife then what are you willing to like do it also just shows that he's well, not in a good place yeah do. like he's just like, being kind of like all about Gemma. really yeah dude you're yeah, a hot you just mess. ripped up oh i know he's just really like well did. the the hard thing is is like i think he has what maybe two hours three hours if he unless he stays up to process the death of his wife, the other part, his any has, has no idea. Right. That that's even a reality for mm -hmm. him. Oh. oh, this reminds me to the notebook mm -hmm. every time. It messes me up. This is one of my favorite songs. I'll be seeing you. Mm -hmm. I freaking love this song. Heart of mine embraces. I love it. I feel really sad for him though. He's just going through so much. I know. His any and his Audi. I loved all these things about her equally. You don't get to see her. <gasps> Dude, what 
did what did I say? What I didn't the f I didn't guess that it was her, but I said, what what are the odds? What are the odds that she crashed her car where she did? So that means she's stuck in there. Uh-huh. Dude. Dude. I knew some dude. And that's why he was like, that's also probably why he was so drawn to her. Be like, that's not fair that she had to go through that and all that other stuff too. Like, uh, ah, yeah. bruh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude. Dude. <sighs> so what special skill does he have that they had to like kill off his wife to make him become severed? To make him want to, what, what does he do so well that they killed his wife? off yeah and why then why that's that's what i'm taking away from this is now i want to know why them what what does he what are they doing what is so special why did they need him so bad or was or really were they just so close to the location or wherever they're at that the recruiting thing and they were like well how else do we get somebody to do what we need them to do like that how low is recruitment that you're killing off people's spouses like that's my thing because you know what's <clears throat> To be completely honest, it'd be way more fucked up. This is just generic fucking recruiting. Wow. Yeah. I don't know. That's... And there's nothing special about Mark at all. Nothing special about him all. At all. I know. God dang it. I want to watch and the next And you know what's episode. even more fucked up? They had his wife do his wellness and light the candle that reminded him of her and had her yeah, do that. Yeah, it's like their candle. How sick. How actually sick and twisted. Yo, I'm like, I'm... Oh! That's wild. We're doing two episodes next week. We're knocking it out in two. I, I, there's no way. There's I know, no way yeah, I'm going to be able to walk down. away from it next week because I can oh, no. barely walk away from it now. I know. Yeah. I'm... Wow. What? what uh, I, That's insane. Or are the numbers... So, but we got or, our, we like, got like, our call to action. We got our call to we action. We got our call to action. In this well, episode. I mean, who got their call to action? I mean, I think I mean? them I being mean, like, let's burn this I think PD was technically the call to action. Yeah, but I'm saying like for the team now. Oh, no. Yeah, the team, like Irv, the team. Irv being like, seeing that he was going, him being alone, being like, oh, I can't believe he called Milchek a motherfucker. Yeah. I cannot believe that. Mm -hmm. yeah, and he yeah, said it with such malice. Oh, I know. Damn. This show has it all. Yep, it's I, I feel like we say that. I, I feel like I say that a lot, but I'm just saying it, this is so good. It's this so is next good. level. They were not wrong. Thank That's... you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Thanks for watching with us, guys, and we will see you on the next one.